hello in this video i am going to show you how you can make login page inside this opinion project so we need to create one login page so here i am going to create a new item a form here login now master page and user master page okay so we need to create here one login page design table tr enter email we are going to perform using email and password so enter email id td and we need to use your text box cut and paste between these now copy paste enter password okay now here we are going to use text mode from this design right click property here text mode password okay now we need one button tr td cross cross span to and then we need to take here a line center and now we are going to take here one button button and here text login and we need to take here one label for giving error message if a user enter in will use any more password then we can give here label label and we do not require this text okay so our login design is ready now i am going to double click here and here we need to do database connectivity so first of all using system dot data using system dot data dot sql client you can copy from here this line copy put here paste now again copy this paste here and end here connection close and here we need to pass select query select star from registration where we need to check our exact column name where email is equal to single double double single quotes plus plus text box one dot text and password is equal to single double double single plus plus sign text box two dot text here i am going to create one integer variable integer t what is it zero data table dt is equal to new data table SQL data adapter DA is equal to new SQL data adapter CMD. Now DA dot fill DT and now TOT is equal to DT dot rows dot count dot to string 
and here we need to pass turnover dot 2 int 32 ok and now we are going to pass here condition a t o t is greater than 0 then we get correct username and password and otherwise else inside this l we can give error message level 1 dot text invalid username or password and here we are going to pass response dot redirect check out dot sps now i am going to run this and we are going to check this ok or not we need to run here login dot sps first of all i am going to enter insert username and password and we get here one error message now here i am going to pass correct username and password i think i enter abc123 and you can see we forward inside this checkout.sps uh, right now we don't have this checkout.sps so we get this but we already forwarded on this so our login page is okay now so this way we can create login page inside the shopping cart project now we are going to bind this login page and registration page with our uh, checkout module in my next video i will show you how we can bind this both with our checkout module thank you so much for watching my video if you like my video then please like it and share it so much in paper can use this thank you so much again